there's a lot of hate everywhere around me and the world and there's a lack of empathy that I've noticed and it's made me really sad, angry, overwhelmed and I don't really feel like there's much I can do about it and it makes me feel small. This is like all I can do. <laughs> is sort of like put myself out there in an open and vulnerable way as a way to sort of respond to that hate and lack of empathy. And that sort of stems from one of my core beliefs for myself where if you really want something, the best way to get it is to give it away. Get it that way. It's really strange stuff. I'm a really, I'm an oddball. Uh, even, so I play underwater hockey and even in that community, I'm considered an oddball, if that describes anything. <laughs> and um, a lot of the stuff I find just walking around Urbana. And so you might find some of your trash uh, framed <laughs> and maybe combined with other stuff that, uh, I've received as gifts or I've purchased and made into other stuff and it's really eh, like a combination of those sorts of things. And if you were to come in there you wouldn't know. Uh, you wouldn't be able to tell the difference between what's been trash, what is trash, and what's something that's really meaningful to me. Unless you ask. There's an admission process to get into this exhibit where I will ask a person why they want to be in my life, the exhibit. Uh, <laughs> and that combined with their donation will determine how much they get to, how much time they get to spend in the exhibit, my life. And all of those donations for admission, 100% of those will be donated to the Courage Connection. The value of these things will be almost completely arbitrary uh, based on my perceived value of the thing and um, the other person's perceived want for the thing. If somebody wants it more and they give a reason for why they want it that's like really admirable, they can have it for less. And you know, there's stuff that I really care about and I really like and it's going to be, it's going to cost more to get that from me. Everything's got a story, but some of the stories aren't very interesting. <laughs> some of them are. <laughs> and uh, if you, if you want to find out the story of the thing, you'll have to ask. That's, that's how it's going to go.